thing that I've seen many times and different versions of it that says we can't distinguish artistic behavior from trauma because our current society produces no untraumatized artistic people. This view has always brought to my thoughts, and I've thought about this before, is that autistic people suffer a lot of health issues, um, particularly in our immune system, migraines, and stomach issues or gastrointestinal issues. Do you know something about all these issues? They're all stress-related issues. Um, I don't know. I'm not saying that this is the only reason why we have it, but I do think they play some role. That when we're always stressed out, do you know when you're stressed out, your stomach doesn't work well? And everyone knows there's a correlation. People get acidic stomachs. People lose their appetite or have excess appetite. People throw up more. I mean, yeah, migraine headaches definitely caused by stress. You know, stress weakens the immune system. So I, I really think we should look into how much of artistic health problems might be just caused by society discriminating against us or all the stress. There was one study kind of like this done with um, so the LGBTQ plus people tend to age faster was correlated to the stress and discrimination and trauma they experienced. And that that was probably the due to that. And you know, one of the most common forms of death in autistic people is suicide. And we have the highest rate of femicide. And we also have way more heart attacks than the average population. Again, something related to stress. I can't prove that all the other medical conditions are stress caused. But I definitely do think it's a big aspect. Well, thank you for this short little ramble and um please like and subscribe i'm trying to reach a thousand subscribers within a year goodbye and if you have any questions leave them in the comment section below or any comments or feel free to dm me